hi beautiful people welcome back to my channel it's your girl again your one and only mama flossy flossy for life so how is everybody doing hope everybody is doing fine and so today video i will be sharing my story with you guys how i was betrayed by a friend or duped by a friend so in this video i will be telling you some little bit details about what happened so it happened years ago when i was pregnant for my twins daughters so i met this girl in my uh, doctor so she was also pregnant then so we just greet and normal nothing much so there was a day i saw her on uh, in a um, bus stop when i was about to go out and uh, we just greeted how is everything doing how are you doing she said she's fine and uh, i asked her what are you doing in my area she said oh is this my area i said yes i stairs around here and she said oh she got an apartment very close to ross here i said oh that is very good so since then it's become friends and um when i had my baby and uh, no 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 it doesn't happen like that so she now asked me that oh your 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 baby born is very big this is not just one child inside i said yes i am pregnant for a twins daughters two girls and she said oh that is great she was so happy to me she was very happy for me and she also told me that she is also uh, her baby is also a girl. I say, oh, I was so happy for her. So when I gave birth to my babies, she came to visit me at the hospital. Everybody was happy. She was very happy. One week later, she, um, I, I came back home, and uh, I think it's about a week or two weeks difference between my twins her her daughter so she put to bed and uh, i was also happy with her thank you god for safe delivering and so on so forth so we are just friends we visit each other sometimes and uh, we go out with the kids together to do some shopping and everything bring the children to playground sometimes so that was how our friendship continued to grow we start sharing some secrets together so i was thinking that oh i have met a friend a best friend to me she was my really good friend because i shared some of my secrets with her some ideas some things you know and it all happened like this so one day she called me and she said oh i have something to discuss with you i said yes okay then we book a ma we book time we had to meet we had to meet so i she told me that oh i want to discuss something with you because i noticed that you spend so much you don't uh you don't save you buy too much of things and it's not good you have to save then i don't even know what is savings how to save what am i saving so what am i saving for then i was a bit younger you know, so I don't even know what is save, how to save, saving for what, what am I going to do with the savings? So any money I just get, I just spend it anyhow. And she said, no, you have to save, use this like this, like this, like this. I said, okay, I will do it. So I start saving this money with her. So I start saving money with her every month. I will give her some money. I will give her some money to keep for me. She was just keeping that money for me. So I have saved about uh, a huge money to me. It was a huge money. Uh, so she now told me that eh, I have a deed to 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 something to do like this like this. If you can do this type of business and uh, and so guys, that was how she came with a business proposal. And uh, after telling me the business, and I said, okay, are uh, we? think over it so i went home after some days i told her okay i'm interested of of the business and uh, she said okay the son the business is going to cost so 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 amounts about uh five to six thousand euros i said what i don't have such uh, money where am i going to get this type of money from then she told me that ah have you forgotten that you have some money with me and uh, you have saved a lot of, uh, of money with me you can use from that money to start so i said yes it's truth okay 
So I asked her, okay, how much are we going to start with it? So she told me that I will bring the, the, the next person so we can discuss it like uh, together. So she called the, the, the guy who is about to, who is the, like the chef of this business. And we discussed and the guy said, okay, this thing is going to cost 6,000 euro and uh, you have to pay uh, 3,500 euro first. Then uh, later you are going to pay the remaining balance. I said, okay, let's start it. So she told me that uh, we, uh, I have to deposit 3,000. So I went to her, I said, okay, I will need that money that I save from with you so she gave me the money uh 3500 euro and i gave it to this guy and so i was waiting hoping that you know this business is going to mature it's going to to bear good fruit and i was so happy so later on things was not going the way she told me again so it, i think three days or four days after i deposit this first payment the guy called me and said, yeah, you know, I have to do this. I have to do this. I have to do that. I need some, uh, I need more money. I said, oh, but we agreed on giving you half. After the day, I will give you the balance. He said, no, you just have to have so, so, so money like this, like that. I said, okay. So I took the remaining money from my friend and I gave it to this guy. I called my friend. Before doing anything, guys, I have to inform my friend first that this is what is going on. This is what is going on. She's aware of everything. So I gave her the, the, the remaining 500 me, me, euro. Uh, so after everything, I was waiting, 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 waiting. Over five months. And she told me that this thing is going to take just two months or three months. Everything will be fine. Everything will be okay. And I waited for five months. There is no good fruit. There is nothing going on. So I start calling her. What is going on? What is going on? Please, can you tell me what is going on? I don't understand. So to cut the matter short, so I, after some months, about uh, uh, six or seven months, the thing didn't work the way it's supposed to be. So I start to notice foul play inside the issue. So my friends start avoiding me. When I call her, she will not pick the call, you know. So there was a day I... I called her. She was telling me that I'm in so 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 place. I cannot speak with you now. I will call you back. And later she called me back and said, "Eh, you are disturbing me. This and that. This and that." I said, "Oh, I'm disturbing you because I cannot he uh, hear from the guy you introduced to me. That's why I'm calling you. If there is a, uh, if she have if he have other number that you can reach him with, or you can just give me the, the number so I can call him, so we can talk because I don't know what is going on anymore. So, hmm." You won't believe what happened. This, my best friend, was shouting, saying a lot of things. I was just trying to help you. Now you have given me, you are giving, you are giving me the blame. I'm trying to help you. She said so a lot of things. She was just talking, talking, talking. I said, I, I haven't gotten to this stage. Just take it easy. I'm the one that is in that my money is involved in this issue. But the way you are just ranting, shouting, talking is like, I don't really understand. So later on, final, final, I now get the guy online. So the guy now said, ah, the business is not going to, to work the way it was planned. So, 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 that's why the business is not going to work the way we plan. And, but I cannot refund back the money. I said, what did you mean you cannot refund back the money? Yeah, because the money was splitted into three places. I was, hmm? Yeah, it was splitted to, to, uh, to, uh, to into three places so i have some part even your own friend have her own part her own share of the money and uh, so there is nothing i can do i said what and uh, the only thing i can do now is to bring my own share of the money i don't want problems since the day didn't go the way it was planned i will bring my own part of the money and give it to you you can go and ask your friend how is her own share and uh, she will uh, Call the other guy and collect the other uh, uh, money from the other guy so that she can give you. I was saying, is this, am I sleepy? I want somebody to wake me up. I'm dreamy. Is this re? So I was so sad. This is the person I call my friends. In fact, my best friend, then. I was so 
angry of her. So when I called her to discuss with her, she was shouting the same, shouting. She was swearing different type of juju, saying different type of things. And later on, I received a phone call from Nigeria, from my mom. She now told me that uh, something is going on, this and that, this and that, that uh, I should be careful with friends, anything that consign money, stuff like that. I should be very, very careful. I should start try to make peace with everybody, this and that. I said, ah, I don't really know how come my mother was aware of this issue if she... According to her, she said it's a revelation. I don't know. So I said, okay. So I discussed it with some a, a, a friend, a different friend. And she said, please take everything easy. So later on, the guy now came with half of the money, which was, I think, 1,500 euro. The guy now gave it to me and said, this is his own share from the money. And he gave me the money back and said, I should contact my friend for the remaining 2,500 Euros. I said, what? So I contacted my friend. I asked her. She said, no, she didn't get anything from me. Too. She, this guy is lying. No, she starts swearing, swearing. Some people can swear, my sisters. Ah, Some people can swear. Even though you catch them, eh? you get catch them red and dead. They will still swear. They will still deny. She was just swearing that she didn't get any share. She was just trying to help me, this and that, this and that, this and that. And... After all, I forgot about the issue because this life, I think if you are alive, you can make more money. So, and I didn't get back my money from her. I only got some part of the money that the other guy, his own share, I only got that one. But the main, the main money, the major one, the, the, the big capital, I didn't get it from my girlfriend. And up to today, she denied that. She didn't get anything from the money, from the uh, the money. She didn't get any money from it. It's a lie. The, uh, the other guy lied against her, which she was not. She was only lying to me. So, guys, that is the story I want to share with you guys. It's very sad for people you call your friend to stab you at your back, to betray you. Is so bad. I don't know what to call it. Is it jealous or whatever? I don't really know what to say about it, but I'm just sharing my own life story with you guys, my experience with somebody I call a friend. So, and I thank God since her, she wiped out, I wiped her out of my life. So since then, my life has become different. I am so happy and uh, God has already blessed me with more than that money that she take. And when I look at her sometimes, I think I know she's, she's suffering for that money because her situation and everything is not what I thought. I don't really know how to explain it. So I thank God for giving me the strength, the power to overcome the circumstances then. And today, I'm happy. But since then, I've learned my my lesson and I'm very, very conscious with people I call my friend and how to deal with people when it comes to money issue. So that is it, guys. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please do subscribe to my channel and uh, share this video to your friends, your loved ones, and let's learn from each other. And if you have any experience such or relating to this situation or something like this leave a comment in the description box i will reply every comment and thank you guys for watching bye